Good morning, hot dogs. I'm back once again. Innocent honor of society, big broadcast more right after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. National Honor Society is holding an essay writing workshop tomorrow after school in room 201. Go to the chatter to reserve your spot with the QR code. A huge reminder that Big Broadcast is this Thursday and Friday at 7 p.m. You'll be able to purchase tickets at the door. Tech is tonight, starts today, and will go on to tomorrow and Wednesday as well. The show order will be posted outside of Mr. Taylor's door. We'll start tonight at 4 o'clock. All crew, please be there by 3.30. Now to sports and weather. Good morning. This weekend was packed with sports events. First off, Elijah Anthony traveled to Grain Bridge Fieldhouse to compete at the state tournament. On his first match, Elijah was able to beat the number two ranked kid in the state, winning 4-3 in a rematch from last year. With that win, it advanced him on to Saturday to face the number seven ranked kid, which he won 7-5. Next, he faced the number four ranked kid in the state semifinals, which he fell 9-1. Then in his final high school match, he faced the number three ranked kid where he fell 3-1. to one. Elijah took fourth at the state tournament. Overall, Elijah has had an outstanding wrestling career here at Frankfurt High School with an overall record of 124-15. and 15. While Elijah competed at the state tournament, the dogs were here at home facing the Southmont Mounties for senior night. The dogs fell in a hard-fought battle against Southmont 52-51. The team defended well, holding Southmont below 14 points per quarter in all four quarters. Riley Goodnight led the team with 18 points, Jay Strode added 12, and Deacon Spencer put in 9. The JV team won 35-32 after being down at the half. The team outscored Southmont 22-17 in the second half. Eli Odom led the team with 12 points, Kane Jarman added 8, and Quincy Perry had 7. After that, the Dogs bounced back on Saturday night against a good 14-5 Tipton team, beating them 57-54. It was a balanced scoring attack from the Dogs with Deacon Spencer leading the way with 17, Kai Kirby, Riley Goodnight, and Jay Strode all added 13. The JV team won 40-38. It was competitive all the way through the Dogs leading 20-19 at the half. The team was led by Eli Odom with 14. Both teams entered the final week of the regular season with two games remaining. They are at Denver on Tuesday and at Delphi on Friday. Last but not least, the boys swim team placed 8th overall at the sectional finals. The best placements include Ethan Cook, where he took 16th in the 100 breaststroke, Galishan, Angeles, Craig, and Phillips placed 8th in the 400 freestyle relay. Congratulations on a good season. That's all for sports. Now to your new weatherman. Good morning, dogs. Coming in today was 37 degrees. The high for today is 57 degrees with a low of 51 degrees. That's all for the weather. Now back to your host. Happy birthday goes to Macy Bird. Happy great day. For lunch today is in lines 1 and 2, Rotini, 3, 4, 4 by 6, Pizza. That's all for Monday's announcements. Hit the like button and subscribe to get more the conversation so you know what we post. Uh, uh, Modification. Uh,